How's it going? It's going really good. That's good. It's good to see you. Yeah, it's good to see you too. Yeah. Um, happy first day of Comic Con. I know. Happy it's first day. It's very exciting. Day. Yeah. Uh, so everybody's still pretty fresh. You know, yeah, we're walk well, around. We're well rested. Nobody's crabby yet. Yeah. Yeah, we haven't gotten our sunburns. Not yet. We haven't got those weird afternoon sunburns, yeah. and then like just sort of. You know, uh, well, I saw a little, a little bit of people already at their wits' end last night at preview night. Just a little bit, but not that much. Oh, okay. So it's yeah. it's teetering the line, but but not there yet. Yeah, not there yet. It's still it's still very fun uh -huh. on Thursday. Did you see anything cool at preview night? I saw a lot of cool stuff at preview night. Let's see. I ran into Billy Tucci, who does a comic book called She. Ooh. You ever seen that comic book? She is a great. Uh -huh. I saw uh, Eric Powell's booth. I went to. Uh oh, do you want me to list all the stuff I saw? Oh, I don't okay, know. Okay, we're gonna speed this part. Yeah, ready, set, go. I went. I saw SpongeBob. Whoa. Um, I saw the most scarily accurate uh, bust of Arnold Schwarzenegger as the Terminator that I have ever seen. Uh -huh. It. I stood there for a second, and I actually thought it was going to start giving me notes on a script I wrote for Arnold Schwarzenegger. It was so lifelike and spooky. Uh -huh. um, very spooky. Worth seeing the... Oh, okay. Yeah, I think it's about something like $30,000 or something like that. Yeah, pocket change. Well, to Schwarzenegger, I guess, who's probably the... Yeah. Who's the most likely person to buy a $30,000 bust of Arnold Schwarzenegger? Arnold Schwarzenegger. Seek whom the crime oh. profits. <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger. Ah, yeah. Does this <laughs> for Arnold. Um... So I'm just going to keep going. Some things oh. I saw. Uh -huh. uh, boy, oh boy, a lot of stuff. Um, saw some good costumes. Obviously, there's already people out in good uh -huh. costumes. It's really good. Yeah. So, question. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we, you saw a lot of cool things, mm -hmm. and there's more cool things to come. So, lot, you're hosting yeah. the Eisner Awards. I'm hosting the Eisner Awards tomorrow night. That's so exciting. I'm ner already nervous about it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good thing to get nervous about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Eisner Awards, because it's, you know, it's, it's sort of like one of the, you know, it's like the heart of Comic-Con. You know, I mean, it's like one of the real, you know, it's like this is all about the comic books. It's not about, uh, you know, um, movies or toys. It's really literally about the comic books. So it, it's, a, it's a big night. I take it very seriously. Mm -hmm. And I've written a big musical number. Oh. Spoiler alert. So it opens with a big musical number this year. Do you want to give us a sample or is it a surprise? It's a surprise, but okay. I could. Well, so what we did is <laughs> I, let, I let OpenAI write some lyrics to, oh. see, what, to see what OpenAI would do. Uh-huh. Yeah, and then I helped OpenAI a little okay. bit. Because OpenAI, we know that the AI is not... Up to speed. I was, you know, this is the first time I ever got nervous about what I was saying about AI in public. Yeah, don't worry, the robots won't get you for another 20 years. I, yeah, I love AI, it's doing great. <laughs> <clears throat> I picked a weird way to sit for the interview, but I'm gonna stick with it. Okay, we have committed. Yeah, we committed, this is, this is the whole time. and then we never did it. I'm gonna get even smaller. Oh. Okay. We have to get real comfy. Okay. So okay. doing the Eisner Awards is going to be a lot of fun. Uh -huh. That's me and Phil Lamar. You know Phil Lamar. He's he, every, the oh voice of literally he's everything. Phil Lamar. The voice of everything. Yeah. Uh, uh, so I was preparing for the Eisner Awards, and I was on a Zoom with uh, Phil Lamar, and my son did not know. Here's a big spoiler alert. Ooh. You've seen Pulp Fiction, right? Uh, no, but continue. We're both going to get a big spoiler right now. Huge spoiler. Can't wait. Can we cut to what happens to Phil Lamar in... <laughs> Pulp Fiction right now. And then when we come back, act like we saw it and then just scream because it was really gross. Ready? Okay. Ah! ah! Oh, wow. Oh, that, that, was, that, that was should crazy. never happen to anyone in mm -hmm. any kind of movie, let alone a Tarantino picture. Um, <laughs> so my son was very excited that the guy who that happens to Mm -hmm. You have never seen Pulp Fiction? I know. Oh, my gosh. I'm the worst. That's okay. It's literally been that movie, and the people are like, you have to watch it. And well, I'm like, oh, I mean, you don't list. have to watch it. You could, you it's just, on you know. my list. Yeah. Have you seen any <laughs> of the Tarantino pictures? I've seen a few. They're scary. He goes very scary. There, there's a bit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, but mm -hmm. side note. Okay, okay. Just go reading that. Eisner's, thing. Phil Lamar. Uh, yes. Big musical number. Very exciting. Yep. Pulp Fiction. Mm -hmm. Next, we have a game for you. Oh, fun. Yeah, you like games? Uh, can I win cash and prizes? Uh, not this one. Keep in one. mind, I'm already pretty wealthy. Mm, okay. Well, this one so, uh, will be a badge of honor. Oh, uh, I have a those. High five, something real cool. <laughs> oh gosh. All right. Okay. Go. Perfect. Okay. So go. the the title of this basically mm -hmm. is is Batman funny. For context, mm -hmm. you are building a sketch comedy team because you are known for your comedy. With only people from the Batman universe? Uh, no, Batman universe, any superhero universe. So I'm going to list off. Names. Let's stick it to DC. Oh, and what would I give okay. them as? And then you're going to tell me whether they are funny. Great. Or not funny, okay. and why? Okay. Okay. So let's start off strong. Batman is he funny? Now here's a really interesting detail. Uh -huh. Batman is not funny. We all know that. Yes. Um, Batman not funny. You know who is funny? Who? Christian Bale. Yeah. 
No, I'm deadly serious. No one ever believes really? that's really true. Yeah, so in, uh, in the Batman picture, one of the Batman pictures, mm -hmm. I mean, one Batman picture, uh -huh. um, and uh, we're filming the scene where I'm talking to, I'm not in a scene with Batman, I'm in a scene with Bruce Wayne, but I tell Bruce Wayne that he can't go hella skiing because he has no cartilage in his knee. I'm the best part of the Batman movies. Okay. We all recognize that. Mm -hmm. I think that's a genuinely widely recognized thing. This is not news to anybody. Um, but Christian Bale is next to me in the scene, and the camera at one point was going to pan from me to Christian mm -hmm. Bale, and I had not really met him yet, you know? So he said, um, he said, Chris, how am I going to know when the camera is like coming over him and coming into me over mm -hmm. here? You know, how am I supposed to know he's going to do that? And I said, Christian, how about this? When the camera is going to pan to you, I'll go like this. Christian! And then you'll know the camera's coming towards you. <laughs> That's incredible. And he laughed really hard. Yeah. And he was like, make sure you do that. That's good. Do that. Uh -huh. And uh, anyway, so uh, Batman, not funny. Yeah. Bruce Wayne, not funny. Christian Bale, very funny. Okay, so he's invited to the truth. Yeah. Noted. Is Superman funny? Is Superman funny? Christopher Reeve's Superman used to be pretty funny. Mm -hmm. I feel like Superman's gotten an, uh, a tremendous amount of gravitas lately. Yeah. That was not necessary. Yeah. I used a weird pronunciation of necessary, but Superman of late, don't you feel like Superman lately has a lot of gravitas? Um, like he's got stuff on his mind that usually Batman should only have on his mind. Yeah, I don't think Superman got, has, should have stuff on his mind. He's gotten darker. Superman's an alien. He's from, not from. He's from a different planet. An animated series, though, like the most recent one. Is he amusing? He's, he's, he's funny. He's, oh, he's amusing. He's, 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 you know, it's ha ha. Mm -hmm. It's a good time. I exist. Oh. Uh-oh. Ready? We're going to go into some multiverses here. I was okay. about to say that don't really exist in the Superman universe. But, so I'm Batman's doctor. Okay. Um, I'm also Chief O'Hara in the Cape Crusaders movies. Uh-huh. But then in the Supergirl series, which is does exist in that, I'm Mr. and Mrs. Biddley. Oh. Yeah. What are the odds of that? Yeah. I know. So I do exist in that universe. Okay. Probably the best part of that universe. Superman not funny. Not funny, okay. To answer your question in the longest way possible, mm -hmm. that took forever. To the point yeah. that I actually forgot what I was talking about and what we were doing. You know, it, it sometimes goes, you know, through the loop, through the woods. It's a, we'll it's find a the point of it. Superman, <laughs> Superman, not funny. Okay. Not funny. Um, is Wolverine funny? Technically, yes, but only because Wolverine is, such, is like as serious as a heart attack, you yeah. know? Not, like, because Wolverine is so unfunny. Mm -hmm. Like, we've gone, we've come, we've come, we've bit our own Wolverine tail. Yeah. We've come all the way around full circle. That being that scary becomes funny again. You know, I In a way that, that, weirdly, like the Joker, is, is never funny. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is about to be really awkward because the Joker's next. Shit. <laughs> Wait, great. Which Joker? I mean, like, it's up to you. Are you canon? Cesar Romero? Like, which, which one are you canon you know in? Uh, I'm... Pretty familiar with all Jokers. Mm -hmm. um, uh, who's the guy from Thirty Seconds to Mars? Jared oh, Leto. Jared, yeah, Jared Leto. Yeah. Obviously, the quintessential Joker. Oh. Um, <laughs> yeah. Fuck you guys! I got all of you. I got everybody in the room. With that's the quintessential Joker. I, mean. I got you all. Checkmate. You thought out. You, oh, you thought you were dealing with rookies. <laughs> um, so quintessential Joker. Uh -huh. uh, Suicide Squad, Leto. Mm -hmm. um, still killing him. Still killing him. Um, probably the funniest joke. Oh, hilarious. And do I mean that in a good way? Obviously not. Yeah. Um, Cesar Romero. Probably the one, the, from page to version of the Joker, mm -hmm. like the funniest, right? Yeah. You know, you know the deal with Cesar Romero just didn't, he just put makeup over his mustache. Does everybody know that? Have you seen that? Yeah. Let's go to a clip of that, and we can and we'll come back. Okay. And we'll go, That's weird, right? Okay. One, two, three. Oh, oh that I was guess. weird. I mean, why I would know, you do why, that? Why would they yeah, do that? Yeah, he didn't like to it. shave his mustache, so he just put makeup over white makeup over the mustache there uh -huh. on his version of the Joker, which was really weird. It's a look. But objectively funny. Yeah. Yeah. Objectively funny. So Cesar Romero Joker, very funny. Mm -hmm. uh, Jared Leto, funniest. Heath Ledger, actually pretty funny. Yeah, no, he, he no, played he it funny. very well. This suit, which was not cheap, by the way. No, it's oh. actually, yeah. You killed the bus driver. 
No, 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 I killed the bus driver. Oh, yeah, no, he's actually, you know, yeah. funny. I'm sorry, I'm running through the whole thing. Yeah, right yeah, yeah, no, no, it's fine. I was watching and then the we got uh, Joaquin mm -hmm. Phoenix. Mm -hmm. Funny? I, I felt more terrified yeah, <laughs> watching yeah, it. Yeah, a little spooky. Yeah, yeah, more, more scary. Yeah, a little scary, haha, -ha. yeah. A little spooky. Yeah, I feel like we should watch it. Which is weird because that guy made The Hangover. Yeah. Yeah, that was a so. joker by the funniest director. Yeah. Yeah. So, so it's one of those. But hands down, Ann Sturski and Hutch. Mm hmm. So Any I, other jokers that we didn't get to who are really um, funny? Who's, uh, isn't... Nicholson. Nicholson. Oh my gosh, how did we forget that? How did we forget, obviously, the most famous... <laughs> objectively, the most famous. Yeah, the most iconic. Funny? I, I feel like it's, it's like, hee-hee funny. Like, Remember when the very... bat dance comes on and he's ruining... He's, he's, yeah, he's, he's, he's like, getting rid thing. of all the paintings, but then he keeps a Francis Bacon, right? Mm -hmm. He keeps, like, a real spooky one. Yeah. I guess he is pretty funny, isn't he? Yeah, because he does funny things. Like he, he, he does. Says, and he also, says his lines, and yeah. it's, it, you, you have that, like, ha-ha reaction from it. Right, and then also, like, his plot where he makes everybody's makeup and combinations mm -hmm. turn them into, make them be all sort of, like, yeah, he's, no, they're very yeah. funny. Yeah, the funny, funniest. Okay. Okay. So, I think we've, we've made a spectrum of funny okay. for this. So what is the we over? We only have 55 minutes left. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm glad we can spend another hour on this. Uh, we'll, we'll put a just, pin in with it. With just the Joker stuff. Yeah, no, I know, honestly. Right, because we haven't done any, really, of the animated versions. Oh my gosh, there's so many. And they just came out Mark with the anim- Oh, Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill? I would say Mark Hamill. Is he one? I, I, or was he is Hamill? He? Yes, okay. Um, funny. Yeah, funny. Yeah. Have you seen the anime Joker? No. It just came out. Who it's, does the voice of anime Joker? You know, I have no idea. I watched the Japanese Let's version. Let's cut to a clip of it. That was amazing. We still oh, don't know, but it yeah, was really amazing. Yeah, we still don't know. That it's, was a great clip, though. I like how they designed mm -hmm. them. It's good. Yeah, it looks cool. Okay. <laughs> Do you think the new crow looks a little bit, is definitely a little bit inspired? They've tried it. New crow has, like, some sort of smiley, oh. smiley evil. He's got, like, those things like a cello has. Yeah. On the F holes. Uh, yeah, the... He's got F cello F holes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think it looks, I mean, it's cool. Yeah, no, it's, no, it's I'm not mad at it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so next one. Wonder Woman. Funny? Funny. Which version? It could be any. We've discussed okay. the whole. Okay, Wonder Woman, Gal Gadot. Is that how we say this? I think so. Gal Gadot. That is how we say that. Yes. Gal Gadot, funniest Wonder Woman ever, funnier than Linda Carter, and here's why I'm going to say why. Because mm -hmm. one thing she said in uh, Wonder Woman 1984, mm -hmm. the movie that I was probably more excited about than anything that's ever happened, Yeah. mostly from the outfit, Yeah. you know, um, at one point, she, uh, the Kristen Wiig character is about to get horribly uh, attacked by weird uh, hobo in a trench coat in the park. Remember yeah. this? Yes. This was sort of a storyline in a big motion picture, which was pretty weird. And Diana, uh, Wonder Woman, comes in and sort of saves her. Yeah. And the line, she, to explain why she had come back and found her before she got attacked yeah, by yeah, yeah. a trench coat guy, the line was obviously, forgot my keys. Yeah. But the way with Gal Gadot's accent, it came out really different. And does anybody remember what it sounded like? No. Would she save Kristen Wiig? Can you do an impression? Yes. She said Kristen Wiig has just been attacked. Wonder Woman Diana shows up, does a cool yeah. thing. And then she just says, forget monkeys. <laughs> and That's incredible. I remember sitting there thinking, we just got told to forget monkeys by Wonder Woman. And I was like, did they ever, were they thinking about maybe we should do one more take? Yeah. Where they're like, hey, gal, it sounded exactly like you said, forget monkeys, which is a very specific thing in English. It means that you are thinking of little primates and then trying not to. Yes. You know, it doesn't mean forgot my keys. Forget monkeys. Next time you watch it, <laughs> and please don't. Yeah. Forget monkeys. That was a great impression. Forget like, the monkeys. It was like Gal was in the room with I us. I could do ADR for her any day. I know, week. man. It's next job. <laughs> no, it's incredible. Uh, Wonder Woman, funny. So okay. very funny, so depending very funny. on what, if the dialogue fits or not. Okay. Mm -hmm. So uh, Harley Quinn. We talked about Joker. Now there's mm. Harley. Now, I'm not going to take the bait. We have 75 minutes left. Oh, we have two minutes. Okay, it's so our last one. You're two not minutes gonna left. Take the bait. I'm not going to take the bait because I was just talking about Wonder Woman having a funny accent. Uh huh. And then you segued right into Harley Quinn. Yeah. And I'm not going to take the bait. I'm not going to take the can bait. You, Harley Quinn is actually about to be played by an actual person from New Jersey, mm -hmm. which is uh, named, her name is Lady Gaga. And then 
it has been played by a lady from Australia mm -hmm. who does the accent of somebody from New Jersey. Mm -hmm. And it's pretty funny. Yes, so yes. Okay. Funny. Funny, okay. Sure. And then, wanna do one more? Yeah, well we have 79 oh, minutes Oh, we have, left? yeah, like okay. two hours, right? Okay, we set up camp, we're ready. And two hours went by. <laughs> oh my God, oh. we have 45 seconds. Oh my God, we have 45 seconds. Is, okay, with news real quick then, is Captain America funny? Captain America, no. Cyclops. Yes. Oh, I like this is a speed round. Okay. okay, ready? Okay, ready, set. The Hulk? Yes. Yes? I don't, okay. I, I, I don't know if to explain these answers, do I? Uh, unless you want to. I don't want to. Okay, ready, set. But I feel uh, like Hulk is objectively funny. He is right? funny. Am I Deadpool. not right? Is Deadpool funny? Yes, but knows he's funny, so that's a different category. Mm, okay, but we'll But Deadpool knows Deadpool's okay, funny. Okay, we'll have a caveat on that one. Yeah, okay, I mean, ready. we love Deadpool and he's very funny. Oh, no, he's hilarious. But we just, when you know it that much, it becomes a different thing, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, it becomes a farce on itself. Okay, Black Widow. Not funny. Not funny? Right? Oh my god, I felt some real misogynist when I said that for oh, some man, reason, because yeah. you they're, looked at me like you're real disappointed. They're gonna get you on Twitter. Okay, I'm like, uh, but wait, when was Black Widow ever funny though, right? Um, right? Oh, everybody's mad at me now. Wow. <laughs> no, there's, there's everybody's moments. mad at the favorite okay. character from any Batman film. We'll cut to clips after. Okay, on. <laughs> uh, Black Panther. Yes, there are some funny. Black Panther's funny yeah, here and there. He is funny here and there. Okay, in the last Here and there. Here and there? Yeah, he's okay. not like, like, yeah. He's not okay. like trying to be Deadpool. He just has some great stuff. And the last question, mm -hmm. Nick Cage, is he funny? Nick Cage is 100% funny. Watch Vampire's Kiss right now mm -hmm. on a clip of it. That was amazing. And we just watched a full movie with Nicolas Cage oh from the gosh. 80s and it was really good. I'm so glad we had yeah. two hours to do that. <laughs> this has been the best day of my life. Yeah, I'm glad. <laughs> yeah, so it's now day. it's Friday here at Comic-Con and this was really, yeah. it was great. I feel like we did a lot together. Yeah, yeah. good luck with the awards. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, thanks. Big butt. <laughs> It's a long night. <laughs> bring it bring a sleeping bag. <laughs>